Hello there, kids. It's I, Stray Cat, and the one and only. Coming with another episode of Fable 2. Alright, when we left off, we were at Not Whole Island once again helping out because the chieftain's being an insufferable asshole. And, uh, it involves going to grab the storm totem, which apparently is necessary. Go to well stop the island from drowning in rain, which apparently is a thing that is happening now since we started. It. Come on, there we go. Since we started the raining last time we were here, apparently now it's just too much. So. Whoop, there we go. Perfect. Ah, there we go. Whoop. That was one hell of a close-up. Got really close in on the ice. Alright. Gotta follow it. Ready to go. Ah, there we go. Now we open this up, and we should be... That's a lot of rushing water. We're probably getting really close. Well, here's hoping we're getting really close. Be the only thing that makes sense. Alright. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh. There we go. Shoot them. Bits. Alright. Fuck it. I'll get this guy up. There we go. Perfect. Sounds like they're uh, having trouble spawning in other places. Maybe if we turn these things off, huh? Which, apparently, we need to do to progress anyway, so. Oh well. The hell? Okay. Gotta be quick on the draw there. Oh, you fuck. Oh, come on. Okay. And... Fuck. I guess the uh, last one is, uh... Magic. Son of a bitch. Did it go? Awesome. Alright. Jeez. That was bullshit. I basically was... I was basically pointing the directional stick, and that was probably why you noticed... You probably noticed my moving around, like, jittering over near the edge. As I was trying to make sure I was directed in the right direction to hit those fucking things, because... I didn't want it to miss for whatever reason. <laughs> oh, jeez. Because that would have just set me all the way back to the start of the whole setup. Hey, one of those turned off. That's nice. All right. Progress. All right. Closer to the storm totem we go, I guess. goes. Just like I thought it would. Perfect. Grab all of these orbs. Eventually. Seems if some of them fall off the edge, it just makes them harder to grab later. Yeah, that's what I thought. What the? Oh. My controller finally died. Alright, give me a second. I was wondering when the batteries were going to give out. It was apparently right there. Okay. Alright, and... Oh, come on. Yes, 
son of a bitch. Is that the last of them? Eh, not really. There's that. There's that. That doesn't. There we go. Whoa. Why did that open five doors? Was five doors really necessary? Okay, I guess it must have been. Just to make sure no one cheats, I guess. By breaking into the first one. Oh, Seems a little overkill to me. Alright. Is that possibly because I'm a lazy fuck? Maybe! Oh, Jesus. Okay, we're doing a banshee killing now. Right. Okay. Oh, okay. Come on. There we go. Now. There we go. Now we can actually do some damage out. Come on. And. Come on. I just want it. Damn it. Too slow. That's that one. You. Children with jazz katanas on their person. Okay, there we go. Not bad. Oh no, puppy's been injured. Hold on, puppy. I need to collect all the orbs that I grabbed and earned. Uh, you. It's healed, puppy. And there we go. Good as new, huh, Double? There we go. Let's get over to the treasure chest now. Yeah, what do we got here? Hopefully something good. Not whole night helmet. Finally, the last piece of the whole fucking set. When the warriors of Knothole Island first began to die out, the local blacksmith created a spectacular armor so anyone might enter the weather shrines. The helmet, in particular, proved far too heavy for the ordinary people of the village. More than one neck was broken through its use. Jeez. Jeez, how fucking heavy is it? It can't honestly be that heavy. How fucking... Can their necks be? There we go. Oh, fuck off. Okay, well, there's this now. Come on, guy. Oh, so everyone I'm able to shoot off will be, uh... Oh, no, Popo. You okay? Okay, dog. Oh, you don't think you're okay. Oh, geez. There we go. Let's go around the back. Shoot. Just to make sure that we get these before we deal with the front, eh? just as I was getting started. Motherfucker. Alright. Uh, there we go. One more. Oh, jeez. Now nah, it's doing the three-prong fucking slam down. Slam down? Ground pound. That's what I meant. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm gonna keep doing that for a while. Uh, 
Okay, well, I think the rest of them we can get from the front now. Just hoping, anyway. And there we are. Okay. Oh, jeez. Camera angle is not great, let me tell ya. Oh, Ow! Doggo! You shouldn't be that close to the troll! Okay. Oh, jeez. Too close. Okay. He's got one last. One last one. Okay. Jeez, that camera angle is not great. Oh, my God. All right. And that did it. Whew! And we can go through. Perfect. All right. Heal up the doggo again. That is the second time in the last five minutes. That's not good. <laughs> then again, we're kind of fighting a troll. It's, it's unavoidable at that point. Alright. Onward we go. Ah, there we are. Ice totem, that's what we were grabbing. Okay. And it just freeze up the rain that's accumulated. And then start them from the same spot where they left off. Well, not left off per se. Same spot that they started when they grabbed me to do this shit for them. Ooh, a dick spot. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake. God. All right, take spot after this, Doug. Uh, always, always more of this. Okay. Good, take it out quick. Damn it! I was hoping, I was hoping I could get a Banshee dealt with for the next one. Uh, never get that opportunity. I always try, but I never get the opportunity. I think I've only done it once. There we go. There we go. It's not like those fights are hard or anything. It just... Kind of creepy, if anything. Like, the fact that it summons up little, like, shadow children. Yeah. Economy value necklace, huh? Eh. Well, isn't really all that worth it. Away we go! Alright. Now it's back to a winter wonderland ish sort of setup. But I wonder what's gonna be going on now when I get to the chieftain. Oh! Oh, they're all gathered in the uh, village center here. Oh, chosen one. You bring light into our lives. Well, thank you, I guess. Alright, what? What will happen here? Gather round, gather round. Uh, thanks to me, your beloved leader, the weather chamber you? will soon open again. And here comes my trusted assistant. He carried Ed out my instructions rather well and deserves a big hand. At least you now, gave me an assistant problems, title. Only I and my assistant will have access to the weather chamber. All I will require is a small monthly fee from each of you as I undertake this strenuous guard. Wow! What? A fee? This was all your fault to begin with! Yeah. Hey. Drop dead! 
not. <laughs> they are not happy about it either. A violent upheaval. I am your chieftain, and this is a very reasonable demand. No, it's not. The only reasonable demand is for you to hand control of the weather to us, to the people. And I'm sure this brave adventurer agrees. You're right, Jessica, I do. Yeah, that's what we want. Weather to the people! Fuck yeah. Have you forgotten who I am? All that I have done for you? You ain't done the shit! The hero stands firmly by my side, and that is all there is to it. You're an idiot. Now don't do anything stupid now. Work with me, and there's 10,000 gold pieces in it for you. Wow. Are you, you really you... going to help this tyrant exploit us like that? Absolutely Join the not. people! Share the power with us! We will flourish, and you'll be in our hearts forever! Absolutely not going to side with this guy. I am absolutely going to help you. Earn the love of the people of Knothole Island. Don't let him bully us around anymore. You're not stupid. You know where the power lies. Right. You don't deserve that power. You've pushed us around long enough. And who's going to lead them if not me? You, mere shopkeeper. Wow. Join me now. What are you waiting for? Go fuck yourself. I know you'll do the right thing. You I'm doing it right now. Fool. You dare turn your back on me? You'll pay for this. One day you will pay for this. Nah. You no, you will. Us. You have no idea how much this means to everyone on the island. We can never thank you enough. You're welcome. You are very welcome. Hey! You have con... Tr ugh, con tr Fuck a do. I talk for a living. <laughs> uh, you have returned control of the weather where it belongs, with the people. You not only have their undying gratitude, you can now enter the weather chamber at any time to make it snow, rain, or flood with sunshine. Alright. Cool beans. Saving content. Yeah. Hey! In the meantime, Hooray! see if there's uh, anything new Have I can get. What it takes the to shops. play the greatest game ever. Oh. Stonecutter. No one I'd rather serve than you. Well, that's that's lovely to hear. I'll admit. All right, anything good? Ooh. Hmm, I definitely recommend that. Oh, I bet you do. I Dear, definitely love it. You won't regret it. <laughs> hey, didn't expect that, but boy, will I take it. Oh, that's wrong thing. There we go. Uh, let's equip that and deal with the augments. There we go. Oh, yeah, I meant to sell some of these. I'll sell them after I pull some of the rest of them off. Augment Remover, which still love the fact that I have that. <laughs> all right. I wish all my customers were like you. I'm sure you do. All right, the Thug Augment. Don't need that. Anything else to sell? Untapped potential. What was that one again? Only. Yeah. Okay. Cause less damage, take more to just gain extra experience. Unnecessary. I should make a profit on that. Discipline. Okay. Yeah, that's not worth it. Thanks. Devastation. It causing additional damage. Which is which is good. Don't get me wrong, it's very good. Tough and deadly, and with each victory you gain extra experience. Alrighty, let's see if there's anything more I can grab. Pain is pleasure. Whoa. Okay. Health is constantly depleting down to 75% of your maximum, and you do less damage against evil enemies, but this is the price you pay to inflict greater damage against good opponents. That's... that's... that's not what we're getting but uh that's 
something to have in the back pocket for sure. Extra damage against unearthly evil creatures such as banshees, shadows, and hollow men, but less against good opponents such as guards. Well, considering I don't usually fight guards anyway, it's probably a good thing to have. But, uh... Hmm. You really should purchase that. I have one myself, and it's great. I'm sure you do. Alright, let's just keep looking through. Combat gives you extra experience, but you hide this you behind a relatively taste. unscarred visage. There's no finer item in this town. Hmm. Renewal. You drain health from enemies with each hit and are less prone to permanent scarring. Yeah. Some of these augments are pretty cool. Another mm, combat I mastery would be nice. That. Luck and life. Huh. When you hit opponents, their health is drained and transferred to you. In combat, you hit harder and are more resilient to damage. You have good taste. You There's have no both. Great skill with the augmented weapon and the ability to cause more damage in combat while taking less. Wow. Some of these are just awesome. Well, I mean, it kind of makes sense, considering. Tend to find gold when you kill enemies and don't really show many scars. That. Amazingly, I the kind of skin myself, care money can buy. Right. <laughs> Alright, that's a way to look at it, sure. Alright, um... Some of these Come are actually back, pretty damn cool. Thank you for your custom. I don't think... I don't think I need anything else. Those are actually pretty great. Sell the weapon that I don't need anymore. There we anything are. Anything else to sell? Up, oh, I didn't mean items. I meant weapons. There we go. I just wanted to see if there was anything in the pistol department. Turret pistol. Not mm, ideal I for me. That. I'll admit. Even though the pepper box uh, look of the pistol is pretty cool, that is still not my style. Those four augments, though. <laughs> Those four augment slots, though. Ugh. That's some good shit, though. I'll admit. Some good shit. Eh, maybe at some point you'll have what I'm looking on, for. But, you can't but not, oh, not now. Nice so All right. Wow. Gordon actually did it. He brought a hero to the island. Haven't we talked before? You're the first outsider in months to step into the box. She's of acting like this is the first time we've talked. I'm pretty sure we've mystery, talked before. And every purchase a surprise. Thanks to you, I've been able to restock my shelves. Although there are still some things missing. Well, of course. You never know what you might find, though. You'll notice each package has a note telling you what exotic item you need to trade for it. Mm -hmm. The rules are on the sign, anyway. Fair enough. Have fun. Alrighty. Eternal love ring for a stylish accessory. Mm. I'll have to look into that. Alright. Uh, what do we got here? Table wine for a lovely hairdo. I just kind of want to look around. Barbaric garments, huh? A weapon of note. Uh, that's a pun. It's, it's got to be a pun. A rare ranged weapon. Pure experience extract. Why would I want to give one of those up for a rare ranged weapon? A strong willed weapon. I would give up a diamond for that, I'll be honest. Did you Pile know Gordon invented that submarine of his? He created some of the best surprises in the shop, too. Did he? Hmm. Crucible peanuts. Well, let's take a look at this. Chasm outfit, huh? Worshippers, <clears throat> sorry, I apologize. <laughs> Worshippers of the Chasm formed an evil sect who believed the world would one day be sucked into an abyss, where true believers like them would rule forever. The fighters among them wore this outfit as they spread terror whenever they went, or whenever and wherever they went. Hmm. A dark figure wearing this outfit appeared one day in the center of town and started to curse everyone in a strange tongue. A hunter threw a harpoon in his neck before he could finish, so it was okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's 
like you're you're entirely sure that that curse didn't follow through after everything that went down that I had to help fix. <laughs> All right, if you say so. I'd say he probably technically completed it, or at least enough to cause some damage. But you know, you marked him with the hunter's spear, so hey, whatever. Probably didn't work all that well. Anywho, I'm just going to end the episode here for right now because we've done the thing that we set out to do. And next one probably will be another side quest. But thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat playing games and... Finally helping the people of Not Whole Island have control of the weather for themselves instead of letting the chieftain fuck a do decide what he wants to do with it for you.